Hi friends, welcome to Edupedia World. This is Varun Ganga. Friends, in our last session we have seen some examples regarding how to find the cube of a given 4 digit number by using Evadunam Sutra when the base is 5000. And now, in this last session, we are going to see one more example regarding the same concept that is how to find the cube of a given 4 digit number by using Evadunam Sutra when the bases are like 2000, 3000, 4000, 5000 etc. So wait a wait, let us see what that example is. So the example that I am going to take here in this session is Find the cube of 9002 So friends, in order to find the cube of 9002 we do have some parts of procedures that we have to follow. So here, the first part of procedure what we have to do is we have to do the left part. So here in the left part, the first step what we have to do is we have to find the nearest base of the given number 9002 and the nearest base of 9002 is 9000. After finding the nearest base, now moving to step number 2, we have to find the axis. The axis here is 2. I think you know that the axis is found out by comparing the given number with the base. So here the given number is 9002 and the base is 9000. So if we compare these two numbers, we get an axis of 2 and it is taken over here. After finding the axis and now moving to step number 3, what we have to do here is we have to multiply the axis with 3. So therefore, by multiplying 3 into 2, we get 6 as the product. By getting this product and moving to step number 4, here we have to add the product what we have got to the base. So therefore, by adding 9000 with 6, we get 9006 as the sum. And this new sum that is 9006 is regarded as the required left part. Now after finding the left part and moving to the next part of procedure that is to the middle part, the first step what we had to do here is we had to take the answer what we have got in the left part and we had to find the nearest base as well as the axis. So here the nearest base of 9006 is 9000 and the axis is 6. So friends, I think you know that this axis is found out by comparing these two numbers that is 9006 with 9000. If you compare these two numbers, we get an axis of 6 and it is taken over here. Now moving to step number 2. Now what we have to do here is, we have to multiply the new axis with the actual axis what we have got. So here the new axis is 6 and the actual axis is 2. So therefore by multiplying 6 into 2, we get 12 as the product and this product 12 is regarded as the required middle part. After finding this middle part and now moving to the next part of procedure that is the right part. Here the first step what we have to do is we have to cube the actual axis what we have got. So here the actual axis what we have got is 2 and by cubing the number 2 we get 8 as the answer. And this 8 is regarded as the required right part. Now after finding the left part, the middle part and the right part here, the base what we have taken here is 9000. I think you know that. And by ignoring all the zeros in the base, we get the number 9. And we have to multiply the left part with the square of the number that is with the 9 square and the middle part with the number 9. So therefore, the left part what we are going to get here is 9006 into 9 square which is equals to 9006 into 81 and the product what we are going to get here is 729486. The middle part what we are going to get here is 12 into 9 which is equals to 108. Now after finding all the parts that is the left part, the middle part and the right part we have to write all these parts in an order like this and we have to place the horizontal parts and the vertical parts like this. After placing these parts I think you know that here the base what we have taken is 9000 and in the number 9000 you can observe three zeros. So therefore we had to take only 3 digits in right part and in the middle part. And in the left part we can have as many digits as we want. So friends now coming to the right part here we are having only 1 digit that is 8. We don't have 3 digits. So in order to overcome this deficiency now what I am going to do here is I am going to add 2 zeros in front of the number 8. So by placing 2 zeros in front of the number 8 we get a 3 digit number and I am going to write this 3 digit number below the hard channel part in the answer like this. Now moving to the middle part. Here we are having 108 which is a 3 digit number. So therefore I am writing this 3 digit number that is 108 below the hard channel part in the answer like this. And finally moving to the left part. Here we can have as many digits as we want. So therefore I am writing the number 729486 directly below the hard channel part in the answer like this. 
and I'm going to place one more horizontal bar below each. And now by combining all the parts, that is the left part, the middle part and the right part, I'm going to get the final answer, that is 729,486,108,008. So therefore we can say that 9002 cube is equal to 729,486,108,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,008,